Hello, Chugging Man. Getting ready for to get tra trained for the boxing tournament. Yeah, I, I, that, that's what I like about the games. Sometimes NPCs have a story. Not always, but sometimes. You don't. You'll never know unless you talk to everybody. That's basically why you talk to everybody in a video game, because everybody has a story. Not, and they don't always have great stories, but sometimes they have stories. Hey guys, Zach Marsh here. Welcome back to Shenmue. It's sleepy time. Um, so we're going, we're almost not the end of the game now. We're actually cl closing in on the end of the game. Landy. There he is. There's the bastard that killed our father. Eventually we're going to kill him. But not for a while. Not for a, quite a few games. Okay, Landy is still at the harbor. Find out more about the trade. Okay, time to move on. We're immediately where we're supposed to be. Do -do. Good morning, everyone. Morning, Mark. Time for a daily warm up race. You all do your best now. Yeah. Okay, doke. Okay. Yeah, eh, sort of. On your mark. Almost time to go. Ready? Go! Okay, racing time. Alright, I'm not going to be an idiot and try to go out of bounds this time. Alright. Can never make these turns correctly. Not when I'm in a hurry. Any other time, yeah, I can do them. But not when I'm in a hurry and trying to get the best possible time in this. Okay. Slow and steady wins the race. As is the tor as the tortoise and the hare, as fun has fondly demonstrated. Thank you, Aesop. Perfect. There we go. I doubt I'm gonna catch up to the guy in first place. If I can come in good enough, I think I'll be able to catch up. Yeah, I didn't do very good. Alright, well, at the very least, I came in four out of fifth. I can, that's about as good as I'm going to get. Man, yeah, Mark isn't happy of, about me. He's not happy I did so poorly. Oh, well. I don't think I'm going to win this before the end of the game, anyway. Even with all the hours and hours of practice that I've gotten into driving a forklift around. I still don't think I'm going to be able to beat it anytime soon. Gotcha. 
Take this cargo to warehouse number 18. 18. Here's the map. The quota's written on it. No problem. This one's a bit further, so don't get lost. Oh, uh, it's a bit further than the one I'm used to? Okay, Doc. It doesn't seem like it's gonna be a bad thing. Also, it's raining. Uh, the quota's still 8. Um... Okay, so it's just... Where do I turn then? I'm assuming here. Yeah. Gotta remember to follow the dot, the straight lines. Gotta remember to follow the solid lines. Out of my way. Out of my... Move! Move! Alright, right here. I didn't get lost. Yeah, this is the place where I need to go. I just need to break eight. Fortunately, I'm in the right... S Fortunately, it's also in Mad Angel's territory, so it might be a bit difficult. I am assuming they're going to make something hard for me. I'm assuming they're going to show up and cause problems. All right. Well... Okay. They're not they're not making it easy for me. I need to learn how, how to, to turn well in advance. Do 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 Yeah, I can make the turn perfectly. But when I'm trying to do the race, I wind up smacking into everything. And then I lose. Oh well, I'm coming in fourth consistently now, so I guess I'm doing alright on the races. I mean, not well enough to get a good prize. I think the highest prize you can, the best prize you can get, um, it is, I think it is dependent on the, I think it is dependent on which, um, forklift you pass in the race, but I think it's, the highest you can go is, what is it called, um, forklift number one, I believe that's the, the grand prize, and if you can ma manage to do, to come in first, you actually get an achievement, um, so yeah. It is worth your time to come in first because you'll get an achievement for your game to score. I'm not entirely sure how much it gives out, but how much it actually pays out, but it uh it's still an achievement.
If you want, if you want to go, if you want to go out of your way to collect all the achievements, I recommend trying to doing your best coming in first, because it is important that you come in first if you want that achievement. But yeah, in any case, that's really the only reason why you would want to come in first, get in, getting an achievement. There are a couple of oddball achievements in, in Shenmue that I didn't get on my first playthrough. Um, but there, but yeah, this is my first playthrough, and I did kind of play it blind. But there are a couple of oddball achievements here or there that you would that you're going to have a hard time finding. Um, some of them I know how what to do, where they are, but I'm not physically sure how to get them. I know physically how to, how the achievements unlock, but I don't know, but I don't know how to phys actually unlock them. Does that make sense? I'm assuming that makes sense. Yeah, it's like the achievement is, it's like I know what I need to do to find the achievement. It, the game is generous enough to give me the answers for that, but it doesn't tell me where, how to unlock them. It just tells me who I need to talk to to actually unlock them and what I need to do, but it doesn't tell me, but it isn't, but it doesn't tell me how to actually solve the achieve the problem for the achievement. It's just there's a couple of oddball achievements that I can't get, like in the like early in the game, you guys, you, if you guys remember in the early episodes of when I played this, there was an old woman looking for a very specific house. Um, help her find the house. You get an achievement. I couldn't find the house though. Because I didn't know that I could zoom in on, on um, nameplates or any of that. So, unfortunately, I, I wound up having to skip on the achievement. But it is... But, yeah, there's a lot of oddball achievements that you may not get in this game. Get out. Box time. I'm doing a good job. Um, I really don't imagine I'm going to be keeping this job, though, considering that, um, Shenmue 2 kind of has to happen, and we kind of don't, and we kind of aren't going to be spending the rest of the game driving around forklifts. So, I would imagine we're going to be quitting our job at some point. Or getting fired. Or both! Possibly both! Time, eh? Okay. I didn't realize that that was a thing. Alright. Hmm. I didn't realize it was cl close to the lunchtime. Am I going to be able to get the rest of the crates in then? Probably. The game usually is pretty generous with my time, but... But it is a little out of the way. Who do I ask around about for the deal going on. Goro? Goro's usually a reliable source of information. Goro. What's growing, bro? What's up? On patrol, brother. Patrol. Okay, never mind. If those nasty bad thugs making trouble in harbor are around. You seem especially happy. <laughs> Speak for yourself. How's work coming? I'm managing. Hang in there, bro. Okay. Sure. Thanks. He seems a little. He does seem a little chipper, though. He does seem like he has a spring in his step. Uh. Um. What? Have you noticed anything unusual around at the harbor lately? Are you Hazuki? Yes, I am. Someone's been asking me about you. Who was it? They looked like a couple of thugs to me. Is that so? Okay. Alright, well, at least my reputation precedes me. That's not necessarily a good thing, considering what my reputation is, Excuse apparently. Me. Yes, what is it? Hi! I want to ask you something. Do you know anything about a deal with the Mad Angels? 
I heard they import illegal contraband and do deals with the underworld. Uh, that was just rumors, though. Do you know where? Well, I don't rightly know. I see. Well, that's helpful. Thanks. What about you? Excuse me. Sorry. We got forklifts coming and going around here. Don't come near here. I understand. Well, that's not helpful. Hmm. Somebody's gotta know something. Anything. If I, if anybody can give me any inf any sort of information, that would be helpful. That I don't know who I would ask. Um. What? Have you noticed anything unusual around at the harbor lately? You. You're Hazuki, right? Yeah. Someone asked me about you. Who was it? They looked like a couple of thugs to me. Is that so? Okay. Alright, well that doesn't help. Uh, this guy is usually not very helpful, but let's see what he says. Got a minute? Do you know anything about a deal of the Mad Angels? No! Okay. I, I, I told you he wasn't going to be very helpful. Oh well. These kinds of things happen. Hmm. Curious, who else would have information? Maybe my old man friend? Maybe you? Excuse me. Yeah. What is it, youngin? About the mad angels? I heard a rumor that you're still looking for them. Yeah. Yes, I am. I heard that they are planning some deal. Do you know about it? The deal? Mm. I did hear something about some large-scale deal happening soon. Have you heard anything else? Well, I don't know none of the details. All right. All right. Okay, well, that's about as helpful as I was expecting. I know nobody really has any information since it doesn't seem like they would, but... Um... Huh? Hi! Okay. Apparently she doesn't want to talk to me. And that's fine. I'm really hoping Tom has information. Tom? Hi, Dio! I want to ask you about the Mad Angels. Do you know anything about some deal they're making? No, man! The Mad Angels are very dangerous! Okay. I need to find out about them, no matter what. Does it have something to do with your father? Yeah. Sure. If you know anything about that deal they're making, tell me. Sorry, I have no idea. I swear, man. I see. Okay, well that's not helpful. Honey, son. Hi, yo. Okay, she's got nothing. Alright. Well, all this seems like it was just a waste of effort, but, eh, well, these kinds of things happen. Actually, I can go in the warehouse when it's closed, right? Can I go check on my warehouse and see if it's... Uh, I can. I can, but the question is, will I be allowed in there during the time... Okay, I got four in here. That's right, I was on crate number five. Well, I'm not entirely sure what's going to help me. Excuse me. Yes? Okay, that doesn't help me at all. What about you, Mr. Fisherman? Um, what? Do you know anything about the Mad Angels? Ah, those scumbags? Do you know anything about them? Sure, that they're real annoying jerks. I sometimes see them dumping these large sacks into the sea. On top of that, they've been really noisy at night lately. 
I really wish they'd keep it down. Sacks okay. dropping thi dropping in the ocean. I know what's in those sacks. That's kind of that's kind of disturbing. Which begs the question of how many times have they actually killed somebody and dropped them in the ocean? Because that is a thing that happened in this game, not on screen, but they have but they have killed a person in the past. Mm. Well, I hang out around this end of the harbor, so I would assume... I would assume somebody over here would know something. How about you, ma'am? Excuse me. Yes? I want to ask you something. Uh, sorry, but I'm in a hurry now. Uh, I see. Okay. What about you? Excuse me. What do you need? Do you know anything about some deal the Mad Angels are making? The Mad Angels? I wouldn't know anything about their dealings. All right. All right, time for me to go back to work, though. Back to work. Yep. Was it number 18? Yeah, it's number 18. Okay, five. I doubt I'm going to make quota this time because it's a little out of the way. But, stranger things have happened. Okay. Well, I didn't get any information about the Mad Angels themselves. Other than that, they're apparently making some deal. Um, they there, there are rumors that they deal in contraband, but there's not much beyond that that I can actually use against them. Uh, I need, I need information, though. Because information is the way you progress the game. You talk to enough people, they eventually give you a thing. But don't take too long, or Landy himself will come along and kill you. And now it and now it actually makes sense. There's actually a story reason for why he's in China, for why he's still in China looking for you. It's because he never actually left. He's been here the whole time. And and eventually he does go he does find out that you have the other mirror and then he kills you. So yeah. Landy's still in the, Landy is still hanging around. I I, I didn't ex I wasn't expecting that as a plot development, but it, now it makes sense why he eventually comes in, comes and kills you. I would imagine, I would imagine otherwise he would have had to have gone pretty out of his way to come back and kill you. But now that we know that he actually is staying, is actually staying in town, until he finds the other mirror, or at the very least makes a deal with the Mad Angels to get the other mirror, it makes perfect sense. Okay, let's keep going. This is number six. Stuck on something. There we go. There we go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And oh, what happens? They beat up Goro. Oh Jesus! What happened? I was just walking with that sailor guy. He. Hey, schoolboy! Come on! <laughs> wow. You, bro. Yeah, he's got to pay for kicking my friend's ass. Hey, over here! <laughs> Wait! He's trying to bait me into a trap, isn't he? He's coming? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! I took the bait! So you showed, eh? You guys again. What's your problem? Better be you. Hey, boy. Ah. Oh, no. Hey, no escape, boy. Okay. That was a, that was another. 
All right. Well, I got information. You guys again. All right. I gotta sit through this again, but. I messed that up again. All right, it's the directional ones that are get tripping me up here. You guys All right, I don't like having to repeat the cutscenes, but they're they're kind of quick time events, so I have no choice. Get out of here. Okay, that's a lot of prompts in the in the same. That's a lot of prompts up to, all together. You guys again. Okay, and this is gonna be difficult. Okay. Well, this is go this is not fun. <laughs> uh, I mean, it is a little bit because quick time events are always a, a little iffy for me. The quick time events are always been are always a little iffy. You never know if they're actually going to be good. But Shenmue does a pretty good job of them so far. Okay. That didn't help me at all. You're gonna pay for beating up Goro. You his girlfriend. What did you say? Best watch your back. Next time it won't be just you. What? We're gonna go after your family and friends. Gonna get them. That's it. Oh. All right. Okay. Well, Goro, I think is I think we helped out Goro. I think he's alive and well now. Yep, there he is. He's all right. He he made a miraculous recovery, but that that's what I as I said, NPCs are a lot stronger than they than they in back in the day than they were now. They're a lot stronger than they used to be. All right, well, this is crate number six, and I don't know how much time I spent dawdling in that cutscene. Okay, that worked. Why? I don't know why it locked up, but apparently it did. All right, we're making progress. Yay. So the Mad Angels are going after our friends and family. I mean, family may be a little bit harder, but friends definitely. I mean, we don't have... We, yeah, Rio's family is kind of gone. I mean, it's kind of the whole plot of the game. He's, he's trying to rev his avenge his father, who is now dead. Um, so yeah... He's trying. He's going on a quest of revenge to help his to help get his father find peace. Um, but he's kind of dawdling a little bit to do it. Uh, at least he's got a lead. He's got a couple of leads, so it shouldn't be too bad. Got to put them in the warehouse. Ah, but I can't put him down. Can't put him down once I pick him up. That's a fair thing. Okay. Well, at least Goro's doing all right. I mean, we helped him out, and we ran off after them. And then we effortlessly kicked some guy, some asses. Because <laughs> Ryo Hazuki is a little bit nuts. Yeah. Ryo's a tough... Ryo is a tough nut to crack. I mean... How, given how many people he's fought up to this point... Um... He's actually pretty... He's actually pretty hard to take down. He's a... He's a bit of a powerhouse because he knows karate or whatever his Hazuki's family style is 
Let's say karate and, and leave it there. And actually, it could be any number of martial arts. I only know one, Taekwondo, and I, I, I learned it. That's, pre that's pretty much the only one I know about, but... I know the names of the of some other ones. I don't know any of the techniques, though. I only really know the techniques of um, Taekwondo. That's really it. Okay, let's move on. I really don't know what that song is, but I start singing it anyway, so there we go. gone now so I can actually go through mm -hmm. pick this up and off we go. Hmm. I think we're getting close to the end of our shift. Big hands and minute hand. Actually, we may have a little bit more time. Hello, jogging man. Getting ready for to get tra train for the boxing tournament. Yeah, I, I, that, that's what I like about the games. Sometimes NPCs have a story. Not always, but sometimes. You don't. You'll never know unless you talk to everybody. That's basically why you talk to everybody in a video game because everybody has a story. Not, and they don't always have great stories, but sometimes they have stories. Yeah, it's getting, it's starting to get late, which means soon or later my shift is going to end. I'm going to get as many boxes in as I can, though, because that's important. That's how I get paid. I'm probably going to get paid a little less because I don't think I have as many crates in there as I usually do. But I make quota, at least. Making quota isn't very hard. <laughs> they, they, they give you a, they, it's been eight consistently for the past couple of these that I've done. Actually, for quite a few of them, actually. Because I don't think it's random. I think it's eight every time. I, or that or the random number generation is just a little bit screwy. And, I've been, and I have just been consistently getting eight every single time. Because that's what the game decided to roll that particular day. I, that, that doesn't sound like something that would be in a game this old. <laughs> it, it's, it may be in a modern game, but definitely not in this one. Okay, 
that's 10. And it's gotta be 5 o'clock, right? I... Yeah, 10 o'clock. Finished for the day. Yep, finished. We're all finished. Which means it's time to get paid. Okay, good job. Here's today's pay. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Keep up the good work. You're welcome. Yes, thank you very much. Oh. Hi, Mark! Hey, Dio. I overheard some information. Oh. Information? I heard them all whispering something about Long Ja. That is soon. Long Ja? Best I can figure, it's some mad angels black market deal. Mm. Makes sense. They've been on edge lately. Long Ja. When's it supposed to happen? Huh. Well, that's helpful. What is the next Long Jaw deal? I can ask around about that, I guess. Thank you, Mark, for giving me some information. Excuse me. What? Do you know what the term Long Jaw means? Long Jaw? What's that? I heard some mad angels talking something about it. Long Jaw? Sounds Chinese or something. Why don't you ask someone else? I see. Okay, so talk to somebody Chinese. I have to hunt down a Chinese person again? Really? I really don't want to have to do that. Do you have a minute? Yes. Have you heard the term Long Ja? Ja, what's that? I heard some mad angels talking something about it. Maybe it's some kind of code name. Why don't you ask someone else? Is that so? Hmm. Well, that's some handy information. Someone else has to know the information. I think the I think the workers might be ruled out. So I should probably talk to important NPCs. Goro! I, I actually no, I'm not talking to Goro. Goro might know something, but then again, he got his ass kicked because of me, so I probably shouldn't bring him in into this anymore. Um, I ain't feeling so good right now. Try me later. All right. Okay. Well, now I'm at a loss. Fine, we'll have to talk to Goro, I guess. Goro! Goro! Stop! It's Goro, come back! I'm trying to talk to you. Where do you go? There he is. Okay. Goro. What's Goro? Got something I want to ask. Sorry, brother. I'm a bit busy now. Got it. Sorry. It's all right. I wonder if somebody will know in here. Doubtful, but can't hurt to ask. Mark heard about Long Jaw. What is it? Long Jaw market dealing. Long Jaw is a market a market dealing between the Chinese and Mad Angels. What is the next deal? I don't. That's a good question. How? Who do I ask about that? Excuse me. What? What? You know, it's really not a good time to talk now. Try again later. Okay. Okay. Excuse me. Yes. What is it? Ma'am? What is it? Are you hungry or something? Don't worry about money. You can eat without paying sometimes. No, it's not that. Oh. Okay, well that didn't help. Go into first person mode. I can't move in first person mode, but that's okay.
Also, can I just take a moment to 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 point out the fact that the camera seems to phase into the back of Rio's head when he goes in the first person mode? It's just a little bit weird. I'm not entirely sure who to ask now. Excuse me. What is it? No, never mind. Oh, well, n oh, the one time you don't actually ask. Great. Hello! Alright, never mind. Eventually, I'm gonna get some information about Longja. Hey. Okay! Something I need to ask you. Can it wait? Got something to do now! Oh yeah? Later then. Sorry! Alright, thank you, girl. You're helpful as always. Excuse me. What is it? Are you busy, Hisaka-san? I also have to work on thinking up a new menu. So, I guess you could say I'm fairly busy. I see. I'm in a hurry, so... Okay, see you later. In a hurry, my ass. You haven't done anything in this po for most of this game. All you do is go about your business and maybe ask a question or two sometimes. Excuse me. What is it? Have you heard about some deal the Mad Angels are arranging? Well, I wouldn't know about that, you know. So you haven't seen any of them around? Nope, but I saw a couple of sailors acting kind of suspicious. The harbor is full of all kinds of sailors, don't you know? Where did you see them? Over by the harbor lounge. Huh. Two foreigners I rarely see are Pearl Longza. I hear they're hanging around the cafeteria. Well, that's... Helpful? Question mark? I mean, it's not a good lead, but it's a lead. So they hang around the Harbor Lounge, which is over here. Do you have a minute? Yes. Have you heard the term Long Jaw around the Harbor? Long Ja? What's that? I heard some mad angels talking something about it. Long Ja? Sounds Chinese or something. Why don't you ask someone else? Is that so? Hmm. Harbor Cafeteria, it says. So. Ah! Nothing. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ask me again some other time. Okay. That's like one of my fit one of my least favorite voices from the bunch that they um, have. Ma'am? Aren't you getting along with the people at work? Let me know if you need someone to talk to. You want something to eat? No, not now. Thank you. Hang around the lounge. Excuse me. What? We're in a hurry, so we don't have time to chat. Goodbye. You've been here for hours. You've been here for hours. In a hurry, my foot. Okay. So it's very slow when it wants to be. I, it makes sense. Don't run into building. I, I know that, but... Hmm. I doubt the game's gonna let me leave until I decipher this mystery. Um, sorry, but I don't much feel like talking just now. Try me later. Alright. 
Okay. And what about in here? Uh, I could I could talk to her. She but she hangs around the harbor lounge. She would know. Yes. What is it? Do you know anything about some deal the Mad Angels are making? Hey, watch what you say. Don't talk about them so loudly. You don't say. About the Mad Angels? You're too fresh and unspoiled. We should aim for better things than life on the harbor. I know all about how to get an audition. No, I'm not interested. Well, that didn't really help me all that much. One game, 100 yen. Alright, apparently there's a game in here that I can play. Maybe yeah, let's try it. it. Screw it. What's the, wor what's the worst that could happen? All right. I missed. I missed. Okay, I I suck. No good. Oh, I, okay. Apparently, I got a lot more darts than I thought I did. I'm getting it. I'm not gonna get a high this score. It. It's a high score, seventy-seven. So close. Ah! Uh, oh! Score. <laughs> okay, that wasn't very hard. All right, I set the high score. I think I'm good. I think I'm good for now. All right. That was that was kind of funny. I wasn't really trying, and I got the high score. All right. Well, there's not much else I can talk to. And can I go home? I wonder if this guy would know anything. I'll talk to him and then go home. Can I help you? Um, uh, I'm just... It's getting late. If you don't have any business here, you should leave now. Okay, though. All right, I'm going home then. Oh, perfect. Perfect timing. Oh, no, never mind. Hi, Mark! Mark? Dio, I got some big news. Huh? I overheard Tony and Smith saying that a long ja is going down soon. Really? When's it gonna happen? Maybe within the next few days. I see. Be careful, Dio. Yeah, you too, eh? No problem. I'm cool, but I'm worried about you, Dio. The date of the right. long jaw. Someone must know. Yeah, but finding out ain't gonna be easy. To them, it's like a really big deal, you know? Maybe the only option is to ask them directly. Well, maybe, but the O. Believe me, I know, but I'm prepared to take the risk. The O. Alright, well. Okay. Hmm. Something got updated? Something got updated, right? There's a lot of side quest data in here. I don't know. 
Two foreigners I rarely see. Tony and Smith are part of Long Ja? I hear they're hanging around the harbor. Oh, it, it added... It adjusted them. Okay. Who's this Tony guy? Oh, Mark's gone home. Mark's not waiting for the bus. Wait, Mark, the bus! Come back! All right, off we go then. All right, well, we're in Dobuida now. Let's ask, I don't think we can ask around about any, anything about it, but. But I should have guessed Mark would have more information than just long ja. Okay. All right. Well, at least I have information. Not much information to go on, but still information. Any information is helpful. It really is, because this game is this game is like pulling teeth. Sometimes you gotta find out. The more information you have, the more you're able to go on and do things. Uh, I don't think this is the right way. Or alternatively, it is. I honestly don't remember how I get home. Wait, I remember. Oh, Nozomi! Hey! When are you leaving? I want to chat. I want to chat with you. When are you leaving for Canada? I don't know yet. It's up to my parents. Ah. But I think it'll be soon. Right. Yeah. Okay. We'll stay in touch, won't we? Yeah. Yes, we will. Absolutely. I promise. I, I pinky promise. Okay, well, time to go home. All right, I'm really, I'm really looking forward to the day when I'm tell, when I'm just outside the house and it'll teleport me back. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. That's gonna be funny as hell. Uh, it feels so long ago I was here, and now I ha and now I'm on to bigger and better things. I mean, granted, the bigger and better things happen to be boxes, but hey, that's not a big deal, right? I'm moving up in the world. All right. Well, in any case, I'm home. So, here we are. Open the door. Pop inside. And say, he and say a quick hello to my friends. And roommates. Okay, Ine is not in here. Alright, let's go inside our room. And save. Okay, we're doing good job. We're doing good job in here. We did a good job. Alright, press the button. Do the thing. And that's game. Okay, well, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. So, we know a bit more information not much just some information um we know what the deal is called we know it's going down in a couple of days but our only way of knowing is to talk to the mad angels who have begun targeting us and possibly our loved ones so it, it's only a matter of time before we find them again uh, um presumably tomorrow but we'll see so in any case i think i'm going to leave this episode here so thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed be sure to like comment and subscribe also, be sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter in the description below. 
And also check out my Patreon in the description below as well. It's only a couple bucks a month. It really helps me out. And you guys get access to a bunch of cool perks that are my way saying thanks. So be sure to check those out in the description below as well. But in any case, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.